of our US students are Herb and Debbie Shoemaker, the parents of Lilith Celine Shoemaker, who is graduating with a double major in Maharshi Vedic Science and Sustainable Living. Herb and Debbie live in one of Maharshi's favorite places, Carmel Valley, California, where Debbie homeschooled her children with a deep reverence for nature and is now an artist and writer. Herb has worked in public service for 36 years as a firefighter and is presently battalion chief with the Salinas Fire Department. Salinas Fire Department, excuse me. I get confused as Salina in Kansas. I always get confused. <laughs> Last year, Herb and Debbie celebrated the graduation of their son, Aaron, and this year it's Lilith's turn. So please come forward, Herb. speakers. All the good lines have been taken. <laughs> so uh, I had a, an acceptance speech written now. I've been working on it for a while, but now it seems that everything's been, everything's been said. Um, I'm, I'm truly, we are truly honored to receive this recognition by the school. Um, and uh, Unfortunately, I'm not, well, unfortunately or fortunately, I'm not familiar with all the names of all the professors and faculty and students, so it makes it really easy just to group everybody and say thanks to a group. So, first of all, on behalf of all the parents in the room and all the parents um, of the graduating class, um, I'd like to speak for them and thank the faculty and staff for the incredible um, opportunity they've afforded our children. And I hope no one is insulted by being ca called children, our students, because as parents, they'll always be children to us. <laughs> we know that they're young adults. But we thank the school for those opportunities that they've afforded uh, us and our, and our children. Uh, secondly, I'd like to um, recognize all the parents and family in the room. And I think you deserve a, a round of applause just for the support and uh, sacrifices you've given uh, to allow your children to be in this place. So, thank you. And then finally, of course, the students themselves. Uh, I've heard some incredible stories, uh, some incredible testimonies, and um, the fact that this is my second uh, uh, graduation ceremony that I've attended. My daughter uh, is number two. My son uh, in the stands here who uh, has done some incredible things. He's actually um, in the middle of a rather large bicycle trip. He, rode 3,000 miles on his bicycle to get here uh, <laughs> to celebrate. <laughs> he, uh, he graduated uh, cum laude uh, in his um, integrative medicine field. And as it turned out, now I find out that my daughter is uh, Magna cum laude in her field, her double major of uh, uh, Vedic science and sustainable living. I'm very proud of them. I had to throw in those plugs. Uh, I'm sure if you were here, you would uh, uh, use that this opportunity also. <laughs> you know, um, I'm I'm so I'm impressed with the quality of these students and. Um, as well as the students that graduated last year and knowing that they're going out in the world as leaders um, in the global community. Um, there is really 
a positive future in store for us. Uh, I'm sure of that now with uh, leaders such as these uh, fine individuals standing next to me. So uh, I thank the school, I thank the parents, I thank the students for uh, all they've uh, all they've gone through. And uh, I really believe that uh, since this is a parent award, um, I, I truly believe that the success of being a parent is measured somewhat by the accomplish accomplishments of their, uh, of their children. And so all of you have a lot to be proud of. We are certainly blessed with, uh, with a uh, very uh, unique and, and strong and uh, powerful future ahead of us. So thank you for this opportunity. I uh, appreciate the, the time you've given. Uh, to all these individuals and the honor you've bestowed upon us. Thank you very much.